Always fall for it. Citizens, save my backside. Be warned that a nest of cobras has been tormenting I've been watching. <sighs> Really, you? Nihal. Mm. I... Mm. Huh. Say nothing, ya Sadiqi. I am as sorry as you. I have so much to tell you. And I you. We will grant each other an audience. But first, I must know something. What? Why are you dressed like a peasant? Perhaps I have less to tell you than I thought. I think I can surmise what our time apart has been like for you. And you? You have not been living here, I hope. <laughs> less living, more working. On what? Why do I know this? Because you have seen it. ...on the object we found at the Winter Palace. I have been trying to remember the specifics of its design. You have spent all this time obsessing over this symbol? Why? Because I too have seen it before. I know not where or when. Only that I have. Whatever it is, it calls to me. I intend to unravel its mystery, and so should you. Ah, but of course. Duty calls. Stop. I will bear it in mind if it means you will spend more time outside these musty walls than you do within. You really do spare a thought for everyone, don't you, Basim? Araki Lahika. The Order of the Ancients are far from defeated. Master Roshan is certain to have a plan brewing to uproot them. And perhaps I should look into Nihal's obsession. It seems Nihal is trying to discover the location of a secret chamber.
Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. I am glad you are safe. Alhamdulillah. A first of many achievements to come, Basim. We should only hope. There's still much work to do. While our focus was on al Ghul, Fulav quietly scouted the city for where we could erect more bureaus. I have found dwellings in three districts that are most unassuming. Ebed and Rebecca have arrived from Alamut and set off to al Abbasia and Karh. I will make my way to Sharqia shortly. And I will join Rebecca in Karh, where corruption is as common as the arid air. See Abu Jafar about some things he's been working on. Then come find us. Have a look, Basim. I may have something that is of interest to you. This should serve me well. My thanks, Ahmad. It's Abu Jaf... <laughs> oh, you jest. Every now and again. Araka lahikan, Abu Jafar. Keep well. And you, Basim. Arrow caught me there. I need your eyes, my friend.
Ah, I see our new Abbasiyah bureau is well guarded by an alert and active Rafiq. Bassem, <laughs> you startled me. I was just enjoying some poetry. Oh, whose? The court poet, Sayyida Arib. Her words chirp like the birds of paradise. Ah, yes, I have read her works. My friend Nihal and I used to sneak into the House of Wisdom when we were young. Hours we spent reading of gods and jinn. I always enjoyed this place. The House of Wisdom is not what it once was. Hmm. Is not our friend Ahmad ibn Musa there? He went to his workshop, as I recall. Yes. I sent a message for him to come and help set up this bureau, but he never replied. My spies could not contact him. A week has passed, and he cannot be found. So? One of the famous Banu Musa is missing in the House of Wisdom. Yes. Venture there and learn his fate. It shall be done. Have you checked the board for new contracts today? Tabit, I would like to ask you something. Please, go ahead. What can you tell me about Ahmad ibn Musa? The son of a famous astronomer. Ahmed and his brothers excel at mathematics, invention, and scholarship. Together, they wrote the book of ingenious devices, describing their wonderful clockwork automata. What made him join our cause? The Banu Musa were once close to Al-Mutawakhil, but grew disgusted with the Abbasid Khilafa. What happened? They refuse to discuss it, so I cannot say. There are many reasons to be disgusted with the Abbasids. Was there anything else? What is important in Abbasiya? This district is the heart of learning in Baghdad. All the world's knowledge can be found here. Any key places to investigate? Follow the trail, wherever it leads. Besides the House of Wisdom, there are other vital landmarks. Be sure to visit the four markets, the observatory, and the Dome of the Ass. I remember the observatory well. I met the great astronomer Al Khawarizmi there when I was young. Excellent. Finally, if you need to soothe so muscles, a steam bath at the splendid Hammam of Abbasia is a joy. After a night of clamoring across rooftops, that sounds good. Was there anything else? Any hint on what the Order might be doing in Abbasia? No, my friend. Not more than what I have told you. Although... No. It is probably nothing. What is it? Any little bit may help. Before he left, Ahmed ibn Musa said something about books going missing from the House of Wisdom. I will keep that in mind. Was there anything else? Tell me more about yourself, Tabid. Me? <laughs> uh, not much to say. I love poetry. Is that enough? Come now. Do not be so modest. <laughs> As you wish. I come from Nubia, a dry land south of Egypt. My father sent me to Cairo to study Islam. There I learned a fiery sense of right from wrong. And the corruption in Cairo was very, very wrong. <sighs> we revolted. Our revolt failed, and I fled to Baghdad. The Hidden Ones took me in, and... Here I am. Someday, you should tell the whole tale. Was there anything else? Thank you, Tabid. That is all for now.
لكني اعتقد ان العقاب كان one of the Thahabin members. I should investigate. Have you ever read the verses in the Kitab al Hey, that pulls me up. You got a nice bit of land off the Kufar road. Date palms for shade, Naharisa nearby for water. The house needs work, though. What happened here? It reeks of smoke. Who burned our precious People, calm yourselves. The fire was small and has been contained. Allah's wrath is upon us. Most of our books are safe. The danger has passed. Old man, how did this fire start? Old man? <laughs> Fazil Fahim is old. As old as the house of wisdom which he commands. Forgive me, Ustadi. I spoke in haste. Can I help? No. The fire has been quenched by the Watermaster's bucket brigades. Who started these fires? Ruffians, I suppose. Enemies of the Khalifa, to be exact. What sort of books were they burning? It is too soon to tell. Perhaps the caretaker of books would know. I am searching for Ahmad ibn Musa. Ah, yes. He has a workshop here, but I have not spoken to him lately. Peace be upon you, Elder. I shall go. I still need to find Ahmad ibn Musa. But I should also speak to the caretaker of books in the library. Greetings, Yaham. If I may, where is the scholar Ahmad ibn Musa? Ah, yes. The most adventurous of the Banu Musa. His workshop is right behind me. Thank you, Yaham. Basim, hey! Nine fingers over here! Nihal! What do you have there, sneak thief? A book. I managed to save at least one from the fire. If they catch you stealing... They cut off a finger. No, wait. A whole hand. That is not funny. Then don't laugh. All right, you are in a mood, and I have things to do. Nothing that concerns you. Oh, secret hidden one stuff. What are you doing this time? Stabbing? Stealing? Stabbing and then stealing? That is your specialty, Nihal. Just because you lost a finger does not mean you've lost your touch. All these tools and books looks like Ahmad's room. But where is he? The letter says these books are for Ahmad. Measuring tools, like my father used to own. But these are Ahmad's. Ahmad always signs his work. This is definitely his doing. working on something new. But what? Diagrams, machine tools, and other oddities. This is definitely workshop. 
But where can he be? Pardon me. May I help you? I am looking for Ahmed ibn Musa. Do you know where I can find him? I may be able to help you. Follow me. Is this your first visit to the House of Wisdom? No. A friend and I used to sneak in as kids. We taught ourselves to read in your library. All young people should follow your worthy example. The caretakers who chased us out of the stacks every day did not think so. Merely doing their jobs. And what did you study in the House of Wisdom? I loved poetry and heroic tales. My friend preferred pagan gods and dark magic. Interesting. <laughs> And did you follow your youthful passion and become a scholar? When the whole world awaits. No. You might say I am a man on a mission. Ah, well. What about your friend? No, no, she still searches for something. Though what that is, I do not know. A shame. It's not far now. Hurry, hurry. Hurt me. You led me into a trap. I should slay you where you stand. Spare kindly, Hamid. Then tell me, where is Ahmad ibn Musa? Please, sir. I don't know where he is. Truly, I do not. Then why lead me into an ambush? He... he made me do it. Who is he? Not Ahmad, surely. I don't know his name. For he always wears a mask. And what does this masked man want? He commands me to keep everyone away from the House of Wisdom's stick site. Or else... Or else what? He will hurt my head. Like with the others. Please, spare humble Hamid. Where is this dig site? It's in the wilderness. Outside of the city. Hey, let me draw you a map. Hmm. The map should lead me to the dig site.
Show me the path ahead. Such a massive dig. What are they up to? Impressive work, my friend. Are you digging up something for the Khalifa? Never you mind all that. The remains of past empires intrigues me. Do you mind if I take a look around? Look at the old rocks all you want, but don't touch our tools and chests. I would not dream of it. This heat makes me ill. I want to vomit. I don't want you here. Mercenaries guarding the site. They must have found something important. When do we get paid, Captain? We will get paid. Are you the leader of this battle-scarred band of war dogs? You must get paid well. Not as much as we want to get paid, I'll tell you that. Care to do a little work for me? Maybe. What's this job, then? See those fancy Khalifa's men over there? I might need a hand. Hmm. Let's work something out. On second thought, I will do it myself. <laughs> Good luck with that. We'll get paid. One way or the other. They don't have much to steal. But it's something. Go away. Show me everything.
Son, praise the geniuses of the House of Wisdom. This work is dangerous and unclean. We disturb the ghosts of ancient unbelievers. Hold on! See if there are any more chests around. <laughs> this chest has Ahmed's signature seal on it. Must be his. Interesting. A letter to Ahmed from a Dr. Hassan. Ahmed must be at the hospital working with this doctor. But what is a famous inventor doing with a doctor? It must all link together somehow. Be Maristan, where the best healers in Baghdad gather. Finding Dr. Hassan should lead me to Ahmed. I need your help, my friend. Ah! 
I need to find a way into Dr. Hassan's office. The symbol of the order. This all but proves that Dr. Hassan is one of them. This letter proves it. Hassan is neck deep in the order. Some scholars from the House of Wisdom got burned trying to save the books. We need that room for the patients. No, that's Dr. Hassan's private laboratory. It's locked. No one must go inside. So we just leave the burned victims outside? Will someone answer me? Please, use your indoor voice. You're upsetting the patients. Dr. Hassan keeps his laboratory locked up. I wonder why.
It's only the mechanism itself. It needs more subjects, more work. I certainly do not need some useless inventor. The doctor is dead. Now to find Ahmed and solve this bloody mystery. Basim, what happened here? Where were you, Ahmed? I was around. I'm always around. Would you tell me what happened? Are you aware this man works for the Order? He called on me a few weeks ago after they found something in the desert. An ancient mechanism of some sort. They needed me to- And you asked no questions. I never ask questions when it comes to work. Do you? Tell me about this mechanism. It opens a path in the mind, a path to the ancient world. This mechanism somehow seems to open the doors of perception. Have you seen this for yourself? No, but I heard the stories of those who have. They are lost, Basim, because they think what they saw is reality. They think they belong to this ancient world. I knew nothing about the order being involved. If I did, I would have come to you. I just... I got caught up. You know me. You know me, Basim. You will leave this place and return to the Bureau. I will not tell a soul if you do not.
How shameful it is that knowledge always ends up in the wrong hands. Isn't it, Basim? A bloody mess. Head bandages. But this is a hospital after all. Do not care for these diagrams. I should continue investigating the library. <laughs> <laughs> 